rally. Hear his party message to potential voters. And the man is begging for your help after items meant as donations were stolen straight off his porch. Theft was all caught on surveillance video. He turned to Action News for help, hoping someone recognizes these suspects. Good evening and welcome to this special edition of Action News Live at 4.30. I'm Elizabeth Gadley. Let's get straight to our top story. A Las Vegas man wants his neighborhood on alert after two women are caught on surveillance video stealing items meant for donation from his porch. It happened at a home near Buffalo and Summerlin Parkway. Action News reporter Michael Burton spent the afternoon with the owner of the home and he joins us live with more. Michael. Elizabeth, this is the home where it happened yesterday in broad daylight at about 2 o'clock. The items were sitting on that porch and neighbors say they didn't see the incident happen, but maybe someone did see it happen and didn't think anything of it. Let's take a look at the video. There seems to be some urgency, but maybe not enough to alarm anyone. Michael Perez, the owner of the home, says it happened when he was out walking his dogs. He got an alert on his phone saying someone pulled to the front of his house. He can access his surveillance camera from his phone. So he saw the whole thing as it was happening. He says the items on the porch were food and toys for dogs donated by a friend of his. He says many of his peers know that he volunteers at animal shelters and does animal rescue work across the city. So they donate goods all the time, usually leaving them on the porch. Yesterday, however, is the first time someone took the items. Michael posted the video to social media and it's been viewed more than 17,000 times. Justice is just finding out who these people are so they don't steal from other people anymore. I don't care that they got the dog food. If they needed it, you know, you can keep it. Michael didn't call 911 and he has not filed a police report yet. He says getting the women behind bars isn't important to him. He just wants to make sure that his neighborhood knows this is going on. Live reporting from Buffalo and Summerlin, I'm Michael Burton, Channel 13 Action News. A breaking